Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Zelda Ocarina of Time. And uh, last time we got the fire spiritual stone, whatever the heck it's called, uh, <laughs> spiritual stone of the Gorons. And this time we got to go get the. Um, I forgot we got this. Uh, we got to go get the sapphire one or whatever. The Zora's the main one, so we got to go see the fishy people. So we're gonna go head over there right now. Oh, fishy people! Oh, fish! Oh, crap! See owl. You're lucky I missed. <laughs> wow, it's the first time I picked up a magic jar. That feels so special. I... Yeah. Thank you, thank you, and thank you. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh. Hoo hoo. Looks like I'm gonna irritate you with some more knowledge. Already, already, already. So. Bloop. Place boom. Boom go boom. Is this the one that has. This is the one that has. Ow! And he fell on me! That was unlucky. Wow, we got one. Oh, yeah, now we can switch back to our uh, Deku shield because it won't get caught it on fire in here. So we're alright. Now we can at least, you know, shield ourselves correctly. What up, chicken? <clears throat> I missed. Ah, uh, yeah, look at this dude just sitting over here munching on seeds. I'll give you seeds. I would like some magic beans, dear sir. Yeah, Tim, that's fine. Wow. It's peas. You know what, I'll take another one too. Uh, here we can we can play a tune for some frogs. Or jump in the water. Crap. Uh, come on, come on, we can make it. Oh, thank goodness. Some frogs are looking at you from under the water. Eh, that scares me. Froggies, I shall play a tune for thee. Look at their eyes. They're horrifying. Uh... <laughs> Those songs, those frogs sing so beautifully. <laughs> oh my god, that one grew. <laughs> Young lad, you play the ocarina well. Hmm. That melody is so fine, Ribbit. We also practice it, Ribbit. Take rubies as a souvenir. Well, thank you. Oh, dang. Oh, that's nice. Well, I'm not going to play another tune because it would be useless. I don't have a big enough wallet. Let me in, you dumb Zora fish. Do you think they would have let me in if I would have sang it that way? Probably. They are dumb Zora fish after all. <laughs> oh, boy. Zora's Domain. Such a peaceful, watery place. Zora's Domain. Yeah, I gathered that. <laughs> uh, okay, so maybe it's because I'm playing on the computer, but I don't remember ever being able to see into the doorway here. Isn't there supposed to be like a cloth or something covering this? That looks ridiculous. It looks like it goes on for so long, but it's like... This rock is very small. <laughs> well, that's the shop. Boy, I had to run like five miles to get down here. Welcome. Fish is 200 rupees? That's ridiculous. For one, you can't carry that much right now. But two, it's like you can just catch one in the water over here. Speaking of, unfortunately, I'm going to have to get rid of my fairy. Because I need a fish. We're going to need it to feed Jabu Jabu. And we're also just going to skip, skip talking to the king right now because we got to go get a letter. Because otherwise... I don't know. Stuff. There we go. Look at our dumb little face. We got a fish. 
So if you were wondering, yeah, that's the Zora King. <laughs> oh, my dear sweet Princess Ruto, where has she gone? I'm so worried. <laughs> yeah, he's too worried to talk to us, so we gotta go and find her letter, which is all the way in Lake Hylia. And I don't, I think we can't dive that far yet, so. Yes, I want to play. Okay, pick up. Oh, pick up all the rupees I throw from here. You only have a limited amount of time. When you pick them up, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. Basically, he just threw all the rupees I gave him into the water. Cool. Start! My rupees! Uh, smacks the bottom of the lake. <laughs> There's one. Yeah, I was gonna say, I might be able to get two. Yeah, I might be able to get these last two also, if I'm lucky. One, two, yeah! Oh, we are quite the diver. Hey, congratulations, I got something nice for you. Come and get it. Oh, yeah. We're underwater. <laughs> what a graceful dive. Now, please, take this. This is a scale of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper underwater. Yay! I got a scale in a bubble. Cool. So now we can uh, dive, I think, six seconds down or however that goes. I don't know. Basically, we can go down here, though. We wouldn't have been able to before because we could only do three. And here we are, Lake Hylia. Wow, it's all connected. Hey! <laughs> Navi's drowning. <laughs> get it, get it, get it, get it. There we go. That's the bottle we need. Cool thing is we get to keep this bottle too, so we have another bottle. King Zora, a letter for you, sir. Oh, this letter is from Princess Ruto. Let's see, she's inside Lord Jabu Jabu. That's a... That's not possible. Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto. But since a strange Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear. Of course you'll go find Ruto. You can pass through here to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle it was in. Take it respectfully. Please find my dear Princess Ruto immediately, Zora. I thought he was gonna move, huh? Uh, I'll just sit here. No, no, you take your time. I really thought you wanted to get your daughter saved, but alright. I'd say this is comical, but it's almost just sad. Oh my gosh, it's finally over. And yes, I'm leaving in the whole thing. You you must see how long that takes. <laughs> you must suffer with me. He's a giant whale! Alright, so... You gotta place this fish in front of him. Which, whenever I played this for the first time, I had no clue what to do here. I don't even remember how I figured it out. That's horrifying. Don't eat me! Eat the fish! Didn't you already get your food? Crap! <laughs> Inside Jabu Jabu's belly. Great. Just great. This reminds me of Pinocchio. Oh, you, you guys, you both missed. Ha <laughs> ha! Your turn. Loser. Ha! No? Okay, well I missed. Wait, there we go. Dink! Alright, it's time to speed through this dungeon. Oh, what's that? Princess b b b b b Bluto, Rudo, Menudo. Rudo, who? You! Who are you? I am Rudo, Princess of the Zoras. What? Are you saying my father asked you to come here to save me? No, I didn't say anything. 
I'd never ask anyone to do such a thing. Letter in a bottle? I have no idea what you're talking about. My father is worried about me. I don't care. All right, you little, sh you little shit. <laughs> anyway, I can't go home right now. And you get out of here, understand? This is, that's rude. How come you get to be in here? Oh, you dingbat. <sighs> here I come. See, I rolled. Did you roll? Probably not. Are you still hanging around here? I told you to go away. I'm okay. I've been going inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly since I was little, but <laughs> why? <laughs> Lord Jabu Jabu is very strange today. There are electrified jellyfish and strange holes all around. Ew. On top of that, my precious stone was, but that's none of your business anyway. You go home now, understand? No. You're that worried about me? Well, I do want the stone, so... <laughs> then I will give you the honor of carrying me. However, I won't leave until I find the thing I'm looking for. You better believe me. I hate my life. You know, you can throw her through these. Ah, oh, well, I missed. But it is funny. I don't know why she makes that noise either. <laughs> You can also uh, activate switches with her. <laughs> I need her chunky butt so I can open up these uh, doors anyway. I'm just gonna set her there because I don't want to bring her in with me. Uh. All right. Can I shoot these? I missed. All right, cool. You can shoot them. That'll work. And there we have it. This should be the boomerang. I hope. It's kind of weird that you get the boomerang before you get, like, the map, though. <laughs> Normally, it's always the map, and then a compass, and then some kind of, like, dungeon-changing weapon. But that's cool. We needed that. There we go. Boomerang power, activate! Do a flip! Oh, well. Uh, Princess Rudo. Uh, Princess Rudo, where are you? How inconsiderate! How could you leave me behind? If you're a man, act like one. Take responsibility. Oh, okay, I see how it is. Yeah, real tough of you. All right, at this point, it's been uh, days later. Uh, I ended up with a cold. <laughs> so I think I'll set her there. Uh, I'm trying to remember what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, we gotta kill these stupid... Uh, I don't know what you call it, uvulas? I don't know. Lord Jabu Jabu's really let himself go. Okay, okay, I gotta get closer. Oh, yeah! You can just keep getting closer and tossing the boomerang. These things suck. A map! Wahoo! Yeah, so I started recording this before Christmas, and uh, then I got sick. And then Christmas happened, so... <laughs> I'm recording this right after Christmas. So, yeah. No, I don't want to listen. Red slimy thing is gone. Yeah, I know. Yeah, chop down all the red slimy things down here in the bottom part of the dungeon so we can go up. Oh, we got bubbles. And I gotta pop all the bubbles within a certain amount of time. Like, what would happen if I didn't? Just game over? Are we, like, in the stomach and I have to get rid of all the stomach acid bubbles before we get dissolved? Oh, I hate this. Okay, hey, that worked. <laughs> the only problem with the boomerang is, uh, the camera angles. Come on. I think this is the last one. I don't care what it is. I've never actually inspected these. <laughs> It'll bounce off your blade, it said. Interesting. Alright, we got another dangly room. Ew. Gangly dangly. It's <laughs> so easy though. Yay! I remember having a lot of trouble with that when I was a kid though. There, oh, there's nothing even in this room. That was just 
literally like hitting a switch. Come on, your highness. All right, here we go. Final room with another dingly. Sit down there. This one's got jellyfish in it too. Oh. Camera angles, I swear. Yeah. Trying to kill all these jellyfish before we mess with the dingly. There we go. Easy squeezy. Oh man, stop hitting my dingly. <laughs> What did we get? What did we get? The door opened. Oh, that's all? Well, it did open up the path to continue the dungeon. So before there was... Oh, gosh, I almost got stomped. There was a dangly right here, but now it's gone since we took care of that. And we can come down here. Oh, my gosh. Look at all the golden skull tools. I think I missed one in the last dungeon, now that I think about it. I'll have to go back and get that sometime. Oh yeah, this room. Oh look, it's the spiritual stone. Throw me up there all by myself. Yeah, okay. Spazoid. Go waddle over there like a toddler. That's nice and all, but can I have it? Just throw it down here. Oh my goodness, I finally found my mother's stone. I got very upset when Lord Jabu Jabu swallowed it. While I was feeding him, he suddenly swallowed me. I was so surprised I dropped it inside. But now I've found it, I don't need to be in here anymore. So take me home right now. Huh, huh, huh. Oh, really? I don't think I will. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> uh, you gotta walk forward. Oh, the elevator goes up. Why does he have an elevator in his stomach? Just a floating nothing. Uh oh. I'm locked in. With a squid! <laughs> Things like pitiful looking. Oh god. Uh. Okay. Don't think I'm supposed to be able to see outside the game so easy. I forget how you do this. I think you gotta get kind of close. You gotta run up behind him. Okay, there he is. Yeah, it's working. Then we gotta hit him with the boomerang. Uh, come on. A little closer. Yeah. Ha ha! Hit you in the butt. Ah! Run the other way. Oh crap, he's going fast. Run faster the other way! This is probably the worst mini-boss fight. I've cut out so much video because of the fact that you gotta run all the way around. It takes forever. And then the last time I did it, he went down into the ground and came up behind me again. It's like, wow, okay, so I gotta do that all over again. Back all the way! Yeah, so this mini-boss fight sucks. There's much better ones. <laughs> He just he just turned around on me. See, that's stupid. Well, it's done. That was annoying. Also, you don't have to hit him three times. You have to hit him four times. So it doesn't even like follow the rule of three, like a lot of things do in this game. Annoying, annoying, annoying. Oh! Uh, don't I have a... Yeah, I got two. This catches a fairy. Oh, <laughs> that's kind of funny because I was like nowhere near it. It was flying away from me, but I still, ca still caught it somehow. Punish Lord Jabu Jabu for having things inside of him. Hey, looky here. We got our Dark Souls uh, shortcut back to the, back to the uh, bonfire. <laughs> He leads us back to this uh, central room here, but now we can go over this way. But since we don't have the princess anymore, our glorified uh, weight, we have to grab one of these boxes. Which is funny, you can actually break these boxes so you wouldn't even have anything. But you can just leave the room, come back in, and they'll be back. I missed. 
This room's full of stomach acid. Ew. Plenty of jellyfish in here. But they're kind of turned into kind of a trivial thing with this boomerang. Wow, I walked right into a golden skull, too. <laughs> this is kind of a neat switch. I mean, it's obvious what you gotta do, but the only way to hit it is to use the boomerang, because it has to go around the web. Okay, well, you gotta scoot up closer in the... Mm. There we go. <laughs> it's like, stop making a liar out of me. This is how you gotta do it. What the... Oh, okay. Oh, we're actually at the boss room, so... This dungeon's way shorter than I remember. Huh. Way shorter. Heck, I think the Dodongo Cavern was longer than this. Whenever I was a kid, I thought that this was the actual brain of Lord Jabu Jabu. This is called Brain... Brainade or whatever. Or Barnade? Is this supposed to be like a barnacle? I don't... I don't quite get the name. All I know is I thought that I basically killed Lord Jabu Jabu. Even though he was alive afterwards. I mean, you don't see him in the future is all I'm saying. Oh, wow. I hit the wrong button. Haha! Oh, I froze all of them? Alright, nice. Ouch! Ooh! Luckily, they put pots all around in this room. They usually have, yeah, hearts in them. Oh, now that was nice. Okay, that was dumb. Turn the camera! Ah, oh, boy. I'm having issues. Come on. Lock on! What is it doing? It's the only problem I have sometimes in this fight. Things are happening a little too quickly, and uh, sometimes the lock on does not want to do what you want it to do. Actually, the majority of the time it doesn't. There's a lot. Of, ah! Right, let's get rid of that jelly. And then. What? Boomerang, work! What? I'm confused. Oh my gosh. Stay locked on. Alright, there. You didn't let me do that last time. Let's go get some hearts. We're, we got messed up. Oh boy. Okay. Chill out. What the heck? Uh, this fight's just no good. Uh -uh. Nope. Uh uh. Okay, I didn't... There was, like, no damage uh, animation for that, though. Come here. Woo! That was close. We did it! Now he has boils. Boils! Yay! Uh, every boss dies in a wonderful... A wonderful fashion. Look at all the squiggly meat on the ground. Oh, it's not moving. Hooray! We have six hearts now. We're getting stronger. I think it's kind of a neat system, really. It's like, yeah, you're just increasing your health, but it kind of feels like you're leveling up. Like, it's a different way of leveling up in the game. Because you can take more hits, so you do feel like you're stronger. Even though all you've done is leveled up your health, kind of. Alright, well. What, what is that face? <laughs> I'm so mad. You left me floating in a floaty portal. I did. 
you, you're late. What took you so long? You're useless. <laughs> I was just lonely, that's all. Just a little. <laughs> that face. Oh, get out of my face. <laughs> Poor Link. Now he's drowning. I mean, I don't think his nose has come up above water once. Oh. Oh my. You! You look cool. Cooler than I thought you would, anyway. Just a little. Well, anyway, you saved me, so I guess I'll reward you. What do you wish? Just tell me. I want the spiritual stone. You mean, the spiritual stone of, the wa of water, Zora's sapphire, don't you? My mother gave it to me and said, I should only give it to the, the man who will be my husband. You might call it Zora's engagement ring. Blink! Swim away! Her most precious possession? You don't know what she's talking about, but you finally collected all three spiritual stones. Go back to see the Princess Zelda. <laughs> the princess of Don't tell my father. <laughs> I'm not worried about him getting up and beating my beat my ass if that's what you're talking about. <laughs> Alright, and I guess that's where we'll leave things for now. Uh yeah, we got the sapphire. Beat the third dungeon, yeah. And uh yeah, next time we'll go into uh, the Temple of Time, get the Master Sword, grow up, and go fight in, I guess, the Forest Temple. So, uh, yeah. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and like and sub, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Wahoo! Flippy-dippy.